If you struggle to fall asleep at night, you're not alone. Many adults experience insomnia, which is a sleep problem that can be frustrating and exhausting. Luckily, there's a medication called Zalpedum tartrate that can help. Zalpedum is a sedative hypnotic drug that works on your brain to help you fall asleep faster and get a better night's rest. It's important to only use Zalpedum for a short time, as directed by your healthcare provider, and to follow the recommended dosage. Taking Zalpedum at the right time can make a big difference in helping you get the sleep you need. Before taking Zalpedum tartrate, make sure to read the medication guide provided by your pharmacist. Take this medication by mouth on an empty stomach once a night, right before you get into bed. Do not take it with or after a meal. The dosage is based on your gender, age, medical condition, and other medications you may be taking. Women and older adults are usually prescribed a lower dose. Do not take a dose of this drug unless you have time for a full night's sleep of at least 7 to 8 hours. If you have to wake up before that, you may experience memory loss and have trouble safely doing any activity that requires alertness, such as driving. If you suddenly stop using this medication, you may have withdrawal symptoms. To help prevent withdrawal, your doctor may lower your dose slowly. Withdrawal is more likely if you have used Zalpedum tartrate for a long time or in high doses. Though it helps many people, this medication may sometimes cause addiction. This risk may be higher if you have a substance use disorder. When this medication is used for a long time, it may not work as well. Contact your doctor if your condition lasts after 7 to 10 days, or if it gets worse. You may have trouble sleeping the first few nights after you stop taking this medication. If this effect continues, contact your doctor. If you experience dizziness that lasts or worsens, let your doctor or pharmacist know. This medication may cause daytime drowsiness, so inform your doctor if you experience this. Your doctor may need to adjust your dose. Keep in mind that this medication has been prescribed because the benefit to you is greater than the risk of side effects. Many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. Contact your doctor immediately if you experience memory loss, changes in mental-slash-mood-slash-behavior, or any serious side effects. A severe allergic reaction to this drug is rare, but seek medical help if you notice any symptoms of a serious allergic reaction. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects. If you notice any other effects, contact your doctor or pharmacist. For medical advice about side effects in the U.S., call your doctor or report them to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov. medwatch In Canada, call your doctor or report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. It is important to be aware that after taking Zalpedum tartrate, some people may engage in activities such as driving, preparing and eating food, making phone calls, or having sex while not fully awake. This can be dangerous and even potentially fatal. If you experience any of these activities after taking this medication, it is crucial to inform your doctor immediately. If you have had this reaction to Zalpedum tartrate or similar medications in the past, it is best to avoid taking them in the future. As always, it is important to follow your doctor's guidance and to use this medication only as directed. Remember to take Zalpedum tartrate just before bedtime, and only when you can dedicate a full 7 to 8 hours to sleep. Before taking Zalpedum, it's important to talk to your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies or if you have a history of certain medical conditions. This medication can have lingering effects, so if you don't get enough sleep or take other medications that make you sleepy, it's important to be cautious when driving or operating machinery. It's also best to avoid alcohol and marijuana while taking this medication. Children and older adults may be more sensitive to the side effects, and it's important to discuss the use of this medication during pregnancy or while breastfeeding with your doctor. It's important to be aware of potential drug interactions with Zalpedum tartrate, as they can affect how the medication works and increase the risk of serious side effects. Some medications that may interact with Zalpedum tartrate include sodium oxabate, azole antifungals, rifampin, and St. John's wort, among others. Additionally, the risk of serious side effects such as slow or shallow breathing and severe drowsiness or dizziness may be increased if Zalpedum tartrate is taken with other products that can also cause drowsiness or breathing problems.
it's crucial to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you are taking other products such as opioid pain or cough relievers, alcohol, marijuana, other drugs for sleep or anxiety, muscle relaxants, or antihistamines. Be sure to check the labels on all your medicines, as they may contain ingredients that cause drowsiness. It's always best to consult with your pharmacist about using these products safely. If you or someone else has taken too much sulpedum tartrate and is experiencing severe symptoms like loss of consciousness or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help. In the U.S., you can call 911 or contact your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. Canadian residents can call their provincial poison control center. Overdose symptoms may include slowed breathing or an unresponsive deep sleep. It's crucial to get help right away in these situations. Remember, it's important not to share your Zolpedem tartrate medication with anyone else, as this is illegal. If you find that your sleep is being interrupted frequently, especially as you get older, there are some non-medication options you can try to improve your sleep. You can speak to your doctor or pharmacist about tips such as avoiding caffeine and alcohol before bed, skipping daytime naps, and trying to stick to a consistent bedtime routine. If you happen to forget to take a dose of Zalpedum tartrate, it's important not to take it unless you have the opportunity to get a full 7-8 to eight hours of sleep afterwards. This medication is intended to be taken at a time when you can ensure you have enough time for a restful night's sleep. When storing Zalpedum tartrate, it's important to keep it at room temperature and away from light and moisture. Make sure to avoid storing it in the bathroom and keep it out of reach of children and pets. It's also important to properly dispose of any expired or unused medication. Consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the best way to do this. Avoid flushing the medication down the toilet or pouring it into a drain unless advised to do so. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.